you know, the remnants of, or the actually still hurricane barrel along the Texas coast, it will become a tropical storm and eventually a depression as it tracks our way. But right now it's nice here in the Miami Valley. Our Jeff Schmidt Auto Group camera out in Beaver Creek, right along 35, just a few scattered clouds, otherwise a lot of sunshine ongoing, and that's helping to warm things already. We started off in the 60s, but now most of us are hitting the 70s. It's 73 in Springboro, Dayton 71 in Eaton and Minster, Union City is 72, 70 in Urbana. If you're planning to get outside for some time out on the back deck or the patio, this morning is probably the best time to do it. Yes, it does feel humid, but temperatures are in the 70s, so it's not too bad. Heading through lunchtime, it is already going to be hot, 86, partly sunny, and then by 5 o'clock up near 90 with a mix of sun and clouds. But we do expect dry weather all day. Unfortunately, we're not going to have much wind to bring relief to these hot temperatures. There are only going to be a wind speeds up between five, six, seven miles per hour through the afternoon. So not a whole lot of a breeze. If you need to get some yard work done, again, the earlier the better just for comfort's sake. But it does look like a good day with dry conditions expected. Tuesday will feature the chance for some spotty afternoon showers and thunderstorms. Not a washout. There will be dry time to get stuff done, but there will be also rain at times. And then Wednesday is looking like a poor day to do grass cutting or any other yard work as we're expecting a really good chance for some rain with the remnants of barrel tracking our way. Thursday, we are back to dry conditions and a good forecast for working outside. Our satellite radar loop shows we've been mostly clear to partly cloudy at times, and that's the way we will spend the afternoon. Future track shows some scattered clouds around at lunchtime and for the drive home at 5, nice and quiet with dry weather continuing. Overnight, clouds will thicken up, and tomorrow we'll start off mostly cloudy in those morning hours. At lunchtime, we'll still be mostly cloudy and mostly dry, but you can see those showers to the west. They will continue to roll in for the afternoon and some spotty showers and thunderstorms will be possible. Not a washout, but Tuesday night and into Wednesday, we start to see better coverage developing as the remnants of barrel track through. Some heavier rainfall will be possible during this time as well, and it does continue into Wednesday afternoon. Here's your forecast for today. It's partly sunny, hot and humid with a high of 91 degrees. Tonight will drop down to 71 with increasing clouds. It'll be pretty muggy tonight. And tomorrow, a very humid day with mostly cloudy conditions, a high of 86 and scattered showers and thunderstorms. Then showers and thunderstorms are very likely tomorrow night and into Wednesday. Wednesday will not be as hot, but it's still going to be very humid. Thursday and Friday, we start to warm up again as it dries out. And then over the weekend, temperatures push back into the 90s.